Mm. The Lake District. You never know quite what's going to come. When the storms hit, it comes in pretty hard. When it's windy and rain and you're getting really chilled and your body temperature's dropping, you're really aware of your vulnerability to the elements. I'm Susie Hankin, I'm an area ranger for the Lake District National Park. I think to live and work in this landscape is an amazing thing to be able to do. Growing up here it drove me to want to work here, experience the things that other people wouldn't. To have this as your office every day, it's, um, it's not too bad really. I think the toughest part of the job is the different weather here. The weather can change very quickly. One day it can be glorious sunshine, but the next it can be torrential downpour. We work outside, no matter what the weather, rain, sun, wind, snow, we're out on the lake. 2015 was a particularly bad year. Storm Desmond hit the lake district. Houses were flooded, footpaths were washed away, bridges were completely destroyed. It was just unbelievable to see what the weather around here is capable of. A year or so on from the flooding, it's amazing to see the resilience of the local community to get back up on their feet after those events. The cleanup effort is still ongoing with the ranger service. There's still bridge repairs and footpath work to be done. been working on the Oldswater Way, which is a fantastic 20 mile walking route. You really get to see some of the high mountains and high fells, but you also get to walk alongside the lake shores of Oldswater, so it really does give you a bit of everything that the Lake District has to offer. Following on from the flooding, it's been fantastic to work on a project which will encourage people to come to the Lake District to see the lakes and the mountains at their best. Working for the Lake District National Park, we are here to protect and preserve it for future generations. So people can continue to enjoy this scenery in this place for years to come. <laughs> <laughs>